A very good evening. We have a Stas Yellow Rainfall warning in situ for three counties later on tonight. It's not good news. We have more on that in just a moment's time. Right across into this evening now. Well past sunset at this stage, earlier on at 20 past four. Already those shares beginning to feed up across Munster, trailing through the Midlands, hitting parts of southern Ulster. Just about holding dry underneath those cloudy skies up across northern Cairns. The best of the dryness and clearest spells into Ulster. Wind's not really a main feature. They haven't really featured all day from a southerly direction, with valleys now wrapping up here Tuesday. Five to seven degrees minus there for parts of Cork and into Kerry. So right across then into tonight. This is where those problems will kick in in terms of the status yellow rainfall warning. That's in situ for counties Cork, Waterford and into Wexford. We're looking at falls up to about 30 millimetres, could be a little bit higher for upward and coastal regions. And again, we are looking at a risk of localised spot flooding and indeed plenty of surface water on those roads. So take it nice and handy if you're driving out and about. Overnight lows there at about 4 to 7, possibly even uh, 9 to 11 degrees there for southern areas. So it is quite a mild night in store down south. Now into tomorrow morning, will be quite a dull, misty and cloudy start. Pockets of sunshine through the Midlands, but that brightness will be limited right across your Wednesday. Indeed, you will get... Uh, uh, some sunny spells there across Waterford and Wexford, but as that cold front tracks eastwards, we will see showers into parts of Clomel, into Bareri, just about holding dry with cloudy spells through the Midlands. 9 to 11 degrees is what we're expecting there for Tullamore and into Longford. Into northern areas, again, that cloud cover extending from much of Ulster into Enniskillen, up around Coleraine and into Strabane. And as we work away then into the west, showers expected for parts of Tubbercurry in and around northern Mayo, but it will dry out with good bright breaks there in and around Athen A couple of earlier showers said across the Iron Islands, but holding drier underneath those cloudy conditions into the latter half of the day. That certainly is the case in around Shannon into Limerick City and County. And once again, following a wet start into the southwest, it will dry out cloudy conditions prevailing there for Bantry into Dingle and out across the Ivra and Beira Peninsula. So all in all, it looks like a pretty dull, pretty misty day in store. Pockets of sunshine quite limited in nature with those winds from a variable direction that you seen out your day. Tomorrow at 7 to 12 degrees Celsius. Now, some of your picks before we let you go. The saving beautiful Robin out and about there in Clarny National Park, County Kerry, coming in from Chris Grace. And next up, a big shout out to all the members of the Waterford City Brass Band who are playing down in Winterville at the moment, down in the southeast. That comes in from Julie Quinn. And then snap of the day goes to John McCannis, who captured a crown and Olig there up in Karen Dunna. That's the Christmas tree there in County Donegal. And of course, the feature on air, just like little Jack and Fiona Smith. Look at the face on Jack, God love us. Uh, he's in Ballsbridge in Dublin. Very happy to see Santa coming in from Dad Brian. Tweet me in our Instagram at Derek underscore TV. We'll catch you a little bit later on following the news at 10 o'clock over on Virgin Media 2. Until then, 6 o'clock show up next. Long.